8,000 migrant workers will get to have improved conditions at seven new dormitories that were built all within the span of a few months. The National Development Ministry says eight more quick-built dorms will be completed by the second half of next year, taking the total capacity to 25,000. Well, QBD's pilot new standards to make dorm living more resilient to public health risks like COVID-19. This dormitory, meant for 1,300 migrant workers, was built in just over four months. And that's why it's called a Quick Build Dormitory, or QBD. Westlight Kranji Way comes with more spacious rooms, which house five single beds each, all at least a metre apart. There's even an ensuite toilet and shower. These features are part of a pilot on new standards that aim to improve living conditions for workers. So far, 340 have moved into this QBD. They'll get to use larger communal spaces, such as these kitchens, that can hold up to 40. There are also more single-bed sick bays per worker and a red zone area to quarantine those suspected of COVID-19. The quick-built dorms are one of the measures to help uh, keep the construction sector on its feet. And that is the de-densification de of uh, living spaces. Our guest workers uh, live in dormitory-style living. These are places where there are high risk of infection. And therefore, de-densification uh, as well as uh, appropriate uh, safe living measures are actually quite important. That's why the dorms designed also to keep workers from intermingling, such as these separate walking paths and different pick-up and drop-off points for work. At the entrance, this machine keeps intruders out while taking temperatures for residents. Other measures include regular testing for workers and cleaning of spaces. Still, such QBDs are only a short-term solution. I don't think that they are expected to last beyond five, six years. So in the interim, we still would need to build more permanent structures that's catered to a more uh, um, sort of uh, uh, long-lasting uh, uh, type of structure so that our migrant guest workers can operate and live out of. We will also endeavour to work with existing dorm operators to see how they can upgrade their facilities and continue the de-densification process. So far, there are seven QBDs located in Kranji, Admiralty and Chachukang. In total, they can house 8,000 workers. Another eight QBDs for 17,000 more will be ready by the second half of next year.